Hey everybody, I just wanted to do a little garden update uh, since it's getting so daggum hot down here. Just about to burn everything up. But I want to do a little update here on my tomatoes that are going on, what's happening here in the garden. I just wanted to show you some of the tomatoes that are coming on these plants here. Been picking some, already got a bunch of them in there on, on the uh, bench. But man, these plants are just loaded with tomatoes. I mean, they are loaded and big. Look at the size of some of these tomatoes. Now, every one of these are heirloom tomatoes. So I'm going to take some of the seeds off of these, save some of them, and replant them next year. We got uh, Cherokee purple, uh, black creme, yellow tomatoes, some mortgage lifters, and some beefsteak, and uh, some Roma, uh, plum tomatoes too but these things is unbelievable the tomatoes that these plants are putting out and just as hard and fast as we can pick them uh, we've been freezing some already they're doing really good but it's getting hot it's coming to an end here as soon as these are they start to turn color I get them off get them in the house so they can cool off let them ripen inside finish off in there because they're getting sunburnt I think next year I might put up a, doing it this late, I may put up a sunshade on them because it's up into the 90s during the day and it's just lucky they're getting some shade in the afternoon a little bit, but it's still burning them up. I got to get them off here as soon as, as, soon as they start to turn. Uh, this here butter lettuce, letting it go to seed this stalk here, a couple other ones. This is all heirloom, so I will save some of these seed for next year. But yeah, these tomatoes are just producing like you wouldn't believe onions are doing good them little sweet 100 tomatoes they just non-stop i bet you we've had 500 tomatoes off of these just two plants two plants of these things here and just just non-stop making tomatoes unbelievable the squash didn't do so good it didn't seem like it was pollinating it was putting out little squash they get about two inches long and they dry up kept doing it kept doing it the plant just got uh, real leggy and running off and so uh, I believe it's uh, it wasn't getting pollinated or something wasn't right with them but yeah look at them tomatoes yes they won't quit they won't quit got some bell peppers here coming up uh, hopefully they'll take off if not well we'll try them next year look at the tomatoes down in there see that they are just covered up with tomatoes green tomatoes they have some fried green tomatoes I'll tell you what these are all jalapeno peppers right here. Got quite a few on there. Yeah, they're not doing too bad, considering so being so late in the season. Right, I'm gonna show you some of the fruits of our labor here on these tomatoes. I'm quite surprised. Hold on one minute. Every one of these come off of those plants out there. I mean, I, some of them are Cherokee purple. Um, mortgage lifters I'm not exactly sure which ones are which now but there is a bunch of them the little cherry tomatoes I just picked them yesterday look at all them Roma tomatoes plum tomatoes them are, them are ready to be canned turned into sauce but look at the size of some of these that thing's big as my hand great big tomatoes now see that one there it got rained on about two days before I picked this one and it split that's what happens they get to, they get so hot but man there are some big tomatoes here look at that some nice ones and a whole bunch more to come well there's a little update just wanted to let you know what's happening in our garden and uh talk to you next time bye now